Do you ever get the feeling that uh, you might have a problem? So I think I might have a problem. And they say admitting you have a problem is the first step. But as long as you can afford it and there's no impact, is it really a problem? Anyway, I digest. Uh, the other item that I ordered that I mentioned on a previous video finally showed up today. And without any ado whatsoever, I've already opened it. We got some Saddleman goodies for the street glide. So we're gonna go ahead and try to get into this one-handed because that's how we roll. There we go, there we go. Second set of hands? Nope. This is half the fun. Find the good end to hold here. There we go. So what we have is the Dominator seat from Saddleman. Very well reviewed by everybody, and I'm looking forward to getting some miles on it, checking it out for myself. Woohoo! All right, so we went ahead and kept with the orange stitch because that's what I got going on. Still got that carbon fiber inlay. Here we've got the spot for the backrest. If I can peel this back, you should be able to pick up, yep, the bracket in there. I didn't get the backrest because I'm not 75. So I don't want the backrest right now, but who knows, maybe one day I'll end up with it. But I like that at least with this, I have the option, whereas with the road sofa, if I want it, I gotta buy a whole nother seat and spend all the dollars on another one and that is displeasing to me. So we're gonna get that seat off, get this one on. You now same process as the other ones for the most part. Oh, shit, I stand corrected. It's a little different, but we still got our or thumb screws here, so that's it. Hey, you know what? Screw it. You're in the way. So, thumb screw and pop that off. There's something underneath, so we'll check back. Hold up. All right, so seats off. We've still got the two stock bolts down here. So we gotta be careful. We'll take, we'll take our nuts off. And then with the new seat, We'll thread it down through here, peel this back, and then thread on the thumb screws that they sent. So that's gonna take more hands than what I have while holding you. So we'll take these off. They're probably a 10 millimeter. Get those out of the way. If they're not a 10, they're gonna be a half inch. It'll be one of the two, fucking everything on here is. So let's, uh, we'll get that dropped on there and we'll see how it looks. All right, with a little bit of swearing, and really tired hands. It's on, looks good. I said you gotta peel this back, see if you can see that. You thread that on there and then it just kind of relaxes down. It does stick up a little bit, but I'm thinking that will relax and chill with some miles. And I think it's ideal so that we can get the pillion in under there if you get the matching one. But uh, I think that'll relax and come down a little bit once my fat ass rides around on it. So it's definitely a little bit trimmer right here through the thighs compared to the road sofa which for me and my minion legs that should actually work out really well so feels good i do feel locked in real well right here which is good because i don't want to fall off now we did go ahead and keep with the the black set almost i didn't want to go super over the top with this one kind of like what i did with the road sofa but yeah, it looks good and there's no getting this off without a wrench because i i ended up having to put a wrench on it to make it work so let's get out here some light. But only took a couple of minutes. Uh, spent more time drinking beer and whiskey before actually getting to the seat. So I'll put a link down below with the way I got this stitched up and done out the door. I want to say it was about 380 or something. But uh, I'm gonna leave it on there and you know put some miles on it. So I'll still keep the road sofa for those of you who have bright ideas. No, I'm keeping it because it's gonna be great. For uh, long trips, it's gonna be great for two up. You know, well, it is great for long trips. It is great for two up. But, you know, for just me, that I like the look of. That looks good. I am gonna get a, a low profile seat screw here, kind of like what the fat boy came with, but I gotta get it in black for there. And the stack O seats or seat tower, seat mageddon, whatever you wanna call it, is growing. That is the stock seat. 
off of the Springer. I'm test fitting a buddy's uh, heritage seat. He's got the 17 heritage, her her heritage that uh, we did the fuel caps on. So, or fuel cap, fuel gauge. And it actually, it, it fits. It doesn't look half bad. It looks a little hippie. It's just a little, uh, little Kardashian-esque. But, you know, uh, when it warms up a little bit, we'll go play with it. It looks a hell of a lot better than that grandpa seat that I came with. So, it's kind of feeling it out. I got some ideas. So, but that's it. Saddleman fucking killed it again. Got no complaints. We'll get some miles on it, see how the thing breaks in. But that's all I got. Questions, comments, concerns, as usual. Drop them down below, and I'll get back at you. We'll catch you later.